It's uh, really nice to be here at the Linda Pace Foundation. She actually came to a gallery that I was running at the time, and that's when the piece in the show was purchased. So it's been a long time since I've seen the work, and I know that she had supported the work and was always um, very happy about that. I often will use a material in a way which is sort of opposite of how one would think it's used. You know, I think that great art is a perfect model to work from because it carries over time. And I often choose works that are from different cultures because I think it's a way to understand the world and by using historical models and I always try to pick from the best things that, are, things that I think are the best. Some of the inspirations that I have for my work often come from historical art and artifacts. For example, paintings um, by Velazquez, works from Pompeii or Herculaneum, and the piece here was from a series from the Tang Dynasty, burial ceramics and Chinese landscape paintings. Uh, the view of gorge was made with, um, carved with um, chainsaw. It's, um, the wood is, is um, basswood or linden, the linden tree, and it's a uh, rather soft wood and very homogeneous. It doesn't have a lot of knots in it. Um, my approach generally to material and the way that I use any kind of medium is that I'll use it for what I want it, how uh, some kind of specific um, sensation, but I don't necessarily, I don't consider myself a master in any of the like I'm not a, a wood carver per se, traditionally. Um, so the basswood is quite an easy wood to carve. Um, and I'm not that patient, so the chainsaw is a pretty fast way to carve. And the work has a lot to do with drawing. It's always the, I always do Watercolors, a series of drawings as, at the same time as um, the sculptures. So this particular piece was inspired by Chinese landscape painting and particularly the idea of um, a scroll painting that I saw, which is a topographical um, view of a... Um, mountain range, and it's drawn in a strange perspective because it's as if you're walking in the mountains, um, but then you're also looking down. And so the idea of the gorge is that you're sort of in this gorge area, the idea of being, um, you know, kind of in a shaft of between rocks, and also there's this macro, micro kind of vision at the same time. I think the idea of, of style is, um, I guess that's the, the overall word these days, but I guess to me if you're actually making um, work that you're very engaged with, then that becomes your style. I make works that are abstract and also figurative at the same time, and I think that often it's disarming because the viewer is looking for a narrative or a story, but ideally it's um, before you is what the work is, and it's a matter of engaging with what you see before you, and that's the ideal.